stopped at a garage sale again and uh, they didn't have anything but they did have a free box so all this I got for free and really just a bunch of several bookmarks that I'll get to the nursing home people this one's pretty nice it was like a, a butterfly or something doesn't have any wings but St. Luke's then the nursing home people this will open up their medicine although I don't I think their nurses open their medicine but anyway then about four of these nice bookmarks grandparents are God's gift to children and the Lord's Prayer grandparents and this is some kind of interesting book a religious book and then uh, freedom is not free free <laughs> I thought that was interesting oh I think it used to hold a manicure set but you can put stuff in there and then these are these are in there so I'm gonna get those to some kids and then uh, I know somebody that is always looking for sewing material same person I'm gonna donate all those that one find worth I where I found those scissors and all the yarn and I mean the thread and all is gonna get that all right on to the next this is from uh, yesterday's dive. I've got several bags and most of it was trash. We've got some vintage. This is Boonton from the 50s. Uh, plastic dinnerware, I guess. Picture I saw had like the salad here and the spaghetti. Lennox is also part of it. Melmac is part of it. This one here I need to look up. I didn't realize it was different. It says Texas Wear. So all of that's from the 50s, pretty cool colors. This is a little soap dish or a powder, powder case, Menda Company from Pasadena, California. I need to glue this little thing back on the bottom of it. Um, this is a mirror, just opens up like that. It's nice and heavy with hearts on it. A few figurine, a uh, little plastic plankton from Spongebob, a nice brooch but it's not, it does not even have a maker's mark and um, we did not get any art work but we did get art supplies so really nice praying watercolors, good brand, the open one is also praying and this thing obviously you know, and just nothing but a bunch of cleaning supplies was this at the bottom and I thought it was silver of course at first. It is pewter and it's made by Pender Brothers English Pewter Sheffield England number 607 real nice uh, sailboat or yacht or something on it and it is it's vintage as well I'm thinking from the 50s, 60s something like that so those are the finds. See y'all on the ne on the next one. The find from this evening were was some a box full of dinnerware and a big poster photograph of the Alamo, which is in my truck and it's pouring rain. So I'll have to snap the picture of that and put it on a, another video later. But um, we had just some regular like this in there and. Um, this pretty plate over here that I'm using under my plant but the most interesting find was this vintage from the 1950s based on quick internet search of plates I really like them they're in incredible condition look like they've never been used they're called NASCO I mean made by NASCO which is supposedly in Japan 1950s called summer holiday there you can see that better. Summer holiday, which that is exactly what it is for me right now. My two nieces are here on their summer holiday and uh, you know we're having fun drawing with Crayolas with things that I got from you know dumpster diving, the paper, the crayons and all that. So um, kind of has special meaning for me. Thanks for watching. Good luck to everybody.